See, far too often we have relegated Jesus to being something that we can understand instead of allowing him to be who he was called to be, who he is, to be God. We think of him as a good example or a wise man or a miracle worker. But the truth is he's the hope of nations. He's the creator and the judge of this world. He's our savior and our deliverer. When he speaks, we listen. He speaks with power. He brings power to the situation, power that you and I can't replicate. It's good news for us. Because you know what? The one who speaks with power is the only one who can call me to a greater righteousness. I don't have to do it on my own. Where the Pharisees and the scribes and the teachers of the law would have come to the people and they would have said, you have to do this and this and this and then maybe you can make a sacrifice and get back to God. Jesus speaks with power from on high and he says, do this because God is with you. Because God has ordained you. Because God is traveling with you on this journey.